it doesn't affect you directly but why did you take this decision yeah <coughs> sorry see uh, that's uh, actually i would like to ask a counter does it have to necessarily affect you personally to take a decision in that way most of the decisions many of the decisions that has been taken throughout by people who had any sort of moral standing or principles would always been could always have been questioned the same thing it did not affect you directly why did you do that mm. now that's exactly the reason and another question is why it should not affect you mm. when a certain freedom of expression is curtailed in a in a section of your own country it's your country it's part of your country it's your people and a certain section of them are not being allowed to express freely the decision is perfectly fine i've been repeating it 370 35a does it's a government's legitimate right to take the decision but it is the people's right to react to it anywhere in a democracy it's a people's right to react to it be it happy be it sad be it upset anger now if that right is denied to that section in our country as a countryman should we not be affected mm. in fact we should all be directly affected by this and we should all be concerned mm. the lack of concern the lack of response to it and the lack of institutional as well as the lack of individual response to it is mm -hmm. precisely the reason that affected me the most and that sort of uh, led me to this question that okay you are asking others this question what have you done for mm. this you are mm. feeling so strongly about this what have you done mm. and i could have only thing that i could have done is to express freely about it that mm. i feel this very strongly and th this is what is best for my country that the expression of all the people should be heard freely but for me to do that my conduct rules does not allow me to speak against such uh, scenarios while being in the service so i thought the decent way to do it is for first put the papers and then uh, you can go on and give your views a right to life as i understand in a democracy has no meaning without the right to liberty the life and liberty goes together that is the beauty of a constitutional democracy if i say that to save your life i am going to put you in jail is it acceptable to you mm. so that is something uh, you know you can argue it for a certain time yes there is a reason you know there is a reason and there is a rationale for doing it mm. but for a long time like it's been 2 3 weeks and even if let's say the administration felt strongly about it i'm okay it is fine the administration's job is to do what it feels to be correct i am against it i feel that no they should be allowed to speak freely